Hi, I'm Daisy, and I'm here to talk to you today about how to stop the spread of fake news on the internet and across social media platforms. Over the last few weeks, across the internet and offline, Nigerian youths have come out to clamor for an end to police brutality in Nigeria with the hashtag NSAS movement. And while we're at it, there has been an increase in um, misinformation and the spread of fake news across Facebook, Twitter, um, WhatsApp, and others, other platforms on the internet. And creation of parody accounts of key actors speaking up against police brutality in Nigeria. And this is wrong, you know. We shouldn't be a party to, you know, spreading fake news across the internet and misleading people. It is our collective responsibility to ensure that we stay on course and focus on that goal, which is to put an end to the police special anti-robbery squad, which is the NSAS movement. But first, what is fake news, you may ask me? Fake news is an untrue information presented as news, and it is, and it often has an aim of damaging the reputation of a person or an entity, or even making money from something that is not real, for something that is not true. So how do you and I put an end to this? You can start by making a commitment today to do these five things that I am about to say. Number one is that you confirm a tweet, a Facebook post, an Instagram image or video you're about to post is true before sharing. Yes, we always want to be the first person to break the news or to share, um, to break the news or to share a new information. But before you do that, make sure you pause and double check that it is true, it is verifiable, and it has a good source. Number two commitment is that you ensure that a Twitter account, a Facebook account, an Instagram account, a LinkedIn account, or whatever account that you're about to engage with on the internet is real before you retweet, repost, reshare, and that it is not a parody account or that is not an account impersonating a celebrity or somebody else. So pause before retweeting, resharing, reposting on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, or any other place on the internet. Number three, you commit to reporting any account trying to incite violence, be it religious, political, um, ethnical violence, or what have you, or an account that is trying to spread lies, fake news, hate speech, or whatever unverifiable, or whatever unverifiable content or information. Commit to reporting them. There are various ways. Social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, and all social media platforms have put in ways for you to report fake or um, scam or accounts that are there to cause um, so please make use of that report tool. It is there. Um, number four, the fourth commitment you make is that you commit to verify voice notes, um, pictures, videos, images before broadcasting them on WhatsApp, Telegram, or any other mobile messaging apps out there. Please verify them. When someone sends you um, a video, a voice note, ask questions. Who is this person? Where is the source? Where did it come from? Can you vouch for this message? Do you think it is true? If they do not have concrete answers to all of this, please do not share. Don't be in a hurry to share. You know, fake news has caused mayhem across the world. Um, a fake news someone might send today here in Lagos, my cousin Avok, far away in Joss. So don't be a tool to violence. Don't be a tool to mis misinformation. Don't mislead people. Then the fifth commitment you're about to make, that you will make, that you commit to making today, is that you commit to deleting tweets, Facebook posts, Instagram posts, LinkedIn posts, videos, pictures, voice notes and what have you whatever content it is that you verify to be false or fake 
when you end up verifying that a post you shared that has over a thousand shares or a thousand retweets is fake please delete it yes you might be tempted to leave it because it has higher engagement you will share posts more posts with higher engagement but you'd have saved lives you'd have saved a lot of things by deleting that post so please commit to deleting posts that you have confirmed to be false at the end of the day you and i is all that we have got and we need to keep ourselves safe both on the internet and offline so my name is olamde once again thank you for coming to my youtube channel if this is your first time watching any video on my channel please do not hesitate to click the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any update from me and we can also continue these conversations at Olamide Yellow across all my social media accounts. Do follow me and let's keep this on. Thank you for watching.